So, Penguin, as of lately, I've been playing Nuclear Throne. Would you like to know about this game? Well, for starters, the game is unfinished. So, it's missing, like, important things, like, you know, the menu and the controls and shit. Like, the listing part that you really want isn't there. And they're like, hey, look, you can play co-op. No, you can't. Not yet. Okay, so you start the game and you can pick from, like, all these different mutants. Each one has special abilities. Like, fish can roll this guy steroids. He can hold two weapons at once. You run around the area and you collect different weapons and ammo and eventually when all the monsters on the map are dead a portal opens up and takes you to the next map. And you just continually keep doing this until you get to the end which is, I guess is the nuclear throne and uh, that's, that's it. You gotta beat the end. And of course, if you get your—you only have one life, so if you get your ass kicked, you have to restart, pick another mutant, and go. Well, that's just it. I'm trying to figure out which one I do like. Like, steroids is pretty cool, but the one robot, oh, he finds better tech, and when he finds a gun that he doesn't need, he eats it. So I guess he gains health from it.
be really nice to know how to switch weapons. I literally had to Google. I had to Google the controls for this game so I could learn how to switch weapons. Oh, and of course, when you collect enough radiation from the shit that you've killed, you get to upgrade stuff. Special abilities for your people. Damage taken is dealt to all enemies on screen, I like that. Man, that guy is really tough. All in all, I'd say this game is pretty awesome. I mean, not much in the way of storyline, but uh, uh, addicting-wise, it's pretty fun. I mean, you just keep playing this for hours, just shooting stuff. If you have the opportunity to pick up Nuclear Throne, it's cheap, and it's fun.